Hey, welcome back. back. Welcome we're back, back to the House of Hopcast. It's another Wednesday. Wait, wait, wait. Yes, sir, running. and you know what that means. We are we're wearing pink. We even got our Barbie juice out. Here we go. Yo, I'm big um I, Jay, we got a lot going on here. Uh thank you for joining us. I am Absolutely, the host. My yes, name always. is Do Hop. Uh, to my right is Jay, the Key Evans, my yeah. co-host, and we got a lot going on here for this House of Hopcast. And um, oh, do we now? Well, <clears throat> well, uh, last week we had a whole topic. All right, did, I'm just going to lead the, with this: where we the were, Mount Rushmore, right? GTS. We were talking about the GTS uh, Mount Rushmore, and I couldn't come up with my own Mount Rushmore. I had said, and uh, I don't want to say promise. <laughs> I could not get my brother here. It turns out Grim's know, a little yeah, busy. Oh, yeah, he's not on, here. Yeah, it turns out Grim's a little busy on Wednesdays. So, um, Whoa! I swear to God. <laughs> does anybody want a cat? I'm, he's I'm, not kidding when he, he says that. What is he doing? Drew Cat Entire makes his appearance yes, here he does. on the That's House of Hopcast yet again. Um, a, a side note to Drew Cat Entire he woke me up this very morning licking my mustache right here. Is that so? Licking it ever so, <laughs> ever so gently. That'd be like, so weird to get waking up to. Well, the th the problem was, it was I don't want to say sweet that he was just so gently oh, licking he's, he's my a, mustache. Right, he's going going deep in your uh, new monster truck box. But the problem was, as he was licking right here, his breath hit my oh. nose. And and it, morning breath. Morning breath. I don't know. He's got all the time hot garbage breath. <laughs> That's what woke me up. I was like, whoa, because his breath was so goddamn bad. I was like, you're only a few months old. How is your breath this terrible already? <laughs> like, usually, like, puppies have that puppy breath. That's like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? For quite some uh, time. There's, there's, there's pups out there. He must have just got done licking his butthole, and then he came over to my face. <laughs> you drew cat and tire. Jesus. All right, so. Um, anyway, now that the cat's done, have uh, you thought it's of your Mount out. Rushmore? You had a whole right. week, a whole week to think about um, the GTS oh, Mount Rushmore. Seven days, I did. And, seven uh, days of <laughs> playtime. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I um, I feel like I could come up with my Mount Rushmore, but it doesn't matter because though my brother is not here. To give us his discussion and his talks about the much more, he did send a statement. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, okay, I, from the board of directors. To, okay, right. We have a, an official via, via official statement, via statement from the uh, GTS CEO Grim about <laughs> the GTS Mount Rushmore. I, I'm I'm very intrigued. I, are you ready to hear it? I'm ready. All right. So here we go. The official statement from Grim about the GTS Mount Rushmore. <clears throat> if there was a GTS Mount Rushmore, I'm going to tell all those mother <laughs> just who should be on there. First up, it's DF Grimm. <laughs> then DF Duhop. Then Ebenezer's Middledorf. <laughs> oh my God. Then Grim Wyatt. Wow. So all Ebenezer's you guys can yeah, snap into a slim wow, grip. I didn't even think of him. What, Grim Wyatt or Ebenezer? Ebenezer, man. Well, I'm just kidding. My brother didn't say any of those things. That's ah. not an official statement, but I did think it would be funny if he did say that this Mount Rushmore would be <laughs> Grim funny. and then me and two of his other gimmicks. Putting himself over. No. Actually, I did I did have a discussion with him when we were filming GTS because I told no, him, I was like, pretty much made the channel, yeah. Yeah, well, I told him, I says, um, I says, yeah, we were talking about it on the Hopcast, and, uh, and he did come up with three. He, you know, he was like... Um, I think he said Peter Kid. He said Slender Dick, right? And I was like, well, I was thinking Apple Balls. He's like, and or it doesn't matter yeah. because they were both great mass characters. He's like, and then me and him. So um, I guess you can kind of take that as one of his answer or his actual answer. But he was definitely um, it definitely tossing around. He had a, he definitely had like at least a top five. Absolutely, yeah. You know, like I said. So um, there's that, guys. GTS oh. Mount Rushmore. Sorry, we didn't get more in depth with it uh, with actual Grim, but um, but I mean, that's we'll take a, it. We'll take it from the well, big man. I was gonna say that that could be an the open discussion. Like that's not something that's a closed book, you know. So we could revisit that. But as for now, 
Um, I want to dive into because we got a lot going on. I, I want to kind of just jump straight into it. I didn't want to. Yeah. Well, I didn't want to be here all day. Um, I'm not feeling great. Jay's yeah, not, not feeling I'm great. Feeling all that best, but I still made it here. Well, that's what we in the hotcast. Well, we figured because we both don't feel great. What would be the point in skipping the hot? You know, it's not exactly. like we're we're, we're going to make each other sick. Or we're it's already feeling point, like yeah. I was going to say we're already feeling like. Yeah. So here we go. I, I do want to get to it. I want to go to w, w E Royal Rumble. Oh, yeah. yeah, the Royal Rumble is this, this sir, weekend. This Saturday. This. What is broken in this cat's brain? Like I, I came home, I fed him, and now all he wants to do is cause a riot. All right. Anyway. Royal Rumble. Right. He took all the steam off of what I wanted to talk about. <laughs> was the WWE Royal Rumble this weekend streaming live on the Pacock Network Saturday night. <laughs> it's not Sunday. I'm super stoked it's Saturday. Yeah. Um, I'm I'm hoping to feel, you know, a lot better than I am right now because I wanted to have the Ninja Twins here and, and um Attack Slug and Al. I don't the think boys. Grim, yeah, I think Grim's not gonna be around. I don't know. Um but with the brandy new Huge yeah, banger TV, seventy-five inch TV, right? Or sent to me from the badass Daniel in Holland. Okay, shout out to Dan from Holland. Always shout out Daniel in Holland. All right. Oh wait, well actually, we'll cheer for Daniel. <laughs> yeah. So, um, with the brand new TV that I got hanging on the wall, I really this is I think the first WWE PLE that I can actually watch on it because I just got it for Christmas. So. With the Royal Rumble, I'm super stoked. I want to feel better than I do. And um, and not only do we have the WWE Royal Rumble this weekend, but we also, Jay, um, have the GTS Regal Rumble. Yes, we do do. So not feeling a thousand percent myself right now, I don't know how that's going to contribute to my performance in the Regal Rumble. I do not want it to alter or 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 whatnot, because obviously I'm there to win two years in a row, three times total. Obviously, I'm there to win too, you know. So I'm hoping to feel a little bit better by uh, by Saturday. You do realize that if um, you're in there and I in there, I you're my bro. But I'm gonna take it to you. It's it's gonna have to. It's happen. brotherly battle. Exactly. It's got to be. Whether I eliminate you or you eliminate me, whatever, it happens. But just so you know, I'm walking out with that ultimate championship. Well, that's my plan too. So we're not gonna stand here and talk. Right, yeah, right, fine, dude. Fine, dude. All fine, right. dude. Let's get to the real topic at hand. The Royal right, Rumble. Really, right, right. Here, let's cheer for the WWE Royal let's Rumble. Let's start it off. Now, it, my biggest problem with WWE and the Royal Rumble right just now, cut me off. Oh, go ahead. I'm sorry. Damn right you're sorry. <laughs> let's start it off. Logan Paul oh. versus Kevin Owens for the United States Championship match. we got to start with probably the first match. Well, uh, well. It, uh, before or you got to that, my point that Rumbles. I was trying to say What's is that, that? W, I, I, I don't want to say I'm irritated with WWE about it, but they've only announced four matches. They're going to be so, I, All right, obviously Logan they're Paul. probably going to go maybe 30, 35. Well, Logan Paul and Kevin Owens, Ooh, the one you just point. spoke about and announced for the United States Championship might be the highlight of this entire night. Do you think so? I'm, what do you think they're going to pull off? Well, let Kevin me, Owens is always looking for that. Let, ask me right now. When that, has oh Kevin God Owens? Moment. When has Kevin Owens ever disappointed the WWE? Never. Universe? Right. Never. Logan Paul has yet to stumble. I mean, the kid's practically broke his arm, leg, and rib, and he keeps coming back. And now he's the United States champ. I have nothing but the highest hopes and Hell expectations yeah. for this to be. The Dude, banger of the night. Like, I think it should worker, be. Solid work. I, I, I'm i almost hoping that it's better than the Rumbles themselves. Yeah. I'm really, I'm really hoping. That and match is going to be great. I can't wait to watch it. Here is your winner. Who you got? Who you got? And uh, still. still. Yeah. Yep. Definitely and still Logan Paul. This is his first uh, WWE United States Championship defense. I can't see him losing it in the first. Um, if Kevin Owens gets the win, it's on a dirty DQ. You know what I'm saying? Where the belt doesn't change hands. Oh, but you, you know what I'm saying? But I definitely think I think Logan Paul's got this one. Yeah, absolutely. 100%. Now, moving on to other championship matches, Jay. Yeah. Okay. There's a um, four way, fatal four way for the Roman Reigns Universal Championship. Okay. Against um, LA Knight. LA Knight, yeah. Yeah. 
Um, Randy Orton. Right, and Randy Orton. AJ Styles. How could you forget about Randy Orton? Well, God. I, oh, oh, I, I dare you. I was focused on AJ Styles because he looks amazing. All right. They both do. Right, and Randy Orton came back and looked so phenomenal. LA Knight, I think he's just getting happy to be there. What? <laughs> I would Shaq be. too. No, he 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 looks great too, but I'm not saying he didn't come back from anything. He's just, you know, killing. Like I said, he's just happy he's to over, be there. Yeah. yeah, he's over. He's happy to be there. And if anybody out there, I'll tell you right now, you can boo me if you want. If you think that Roman Reigns is gonna lose this championship belt at, at the Royal Rumble, well, my friend, I got some bad news for you. Yeah, he was your winner insane. and still Universal Champion Roman Reigns, and I'll tell you why. And this it, this leads into talking about the Rumble. So I'm gonna put this out there before we talk about who we think are gonna win these Royal Rumbles, or at least the men's. Like I said, because we're focusing here on Roman Reigns. Let me tell you that Roman Reigns will not lose this Universal Championship because of the championship lineage that's attached to it until he beats Hulk Hogan's record of. 1540 something days or whatever it is. Okay. Which puts it post WrestleMania. But at SummerSlam, Roman Reigns could lose that title and beat Hogan's record. So, Jay, before we get to picking who's going to win the Men's Royal Rumble, okay, just know that if you think Cody's going to win and then go to WrestleMania and finish the story, it won't happen. These are facts, people. He will hold that belt. They are flushing, um, not, not flushing Hulk Hogan out of WWE history, but much like the Intercontinental Championship, now Gunther could lose it because he's beaten Honky Tonk's record. But Gunther's in the Rumble, so he will be champion for longer. Okay? Yeah. They're pushing Hogan off those record books. Roman Reigns is this close to doing it. They're not going to do this again with anybody else. Roman Reigns will do that. So picking Cody and telling me that he's going to finish the story, I'm going to put you through a table. Anybody. Put you through a table. So, no, let, no, I, I, you're not wrong. You know? So let's move now to the Men's Royal Rumble. And i got to be honest, and another irritating thing is that they've really only announced, uh, confirmed, rather, eight. Or nine guys, and I have a list right here from Cody Rhodes, CM Punk, Shinsuke Nakamura, Bobby Lashley, Drew McIntyre, Gunther, Chad Gable, Otis, Tazawa, Kofi, and Damian Priest. Those are the only confirmed. And what is that, 10? So you got 20 entries of... Oh, that, that's going to make this pretty fun, I'd say. Right. So... Um, you know. Anybody returning? Who do you, who do you honestly think is going to go over? Because, again, if they go to Mania to face Roman, they will lose. CM Punk. To face Rollins at Mania. Yeah. And Rollins isn't going to work because he's injured, and he's going to just work Mania injured and then probably drop that title to whoever challenges him. Yeah. yeah I, that's a, that's another... Or... Well, not Goon. I don't think Goon's there. I don't think they'll make him double champ. That, that... Nah, he'll, if that's the case, he'll drop it like... At Elimination oh, yeah. Chamber. But, I mean, that's a quick turnaround to throw him in that feud. I'd build that up at least another year. For, uh, if, if they were going to do that in Mania. Shotgun. With, with, <laughs> this is not AEW shotgun booking. <laughs> All right. Boo you, Jay, for thinking so. I know, I know. All right. <laughs> As for me, I kinda th I'm, I'm kind of on the same lines there. I feel like whoever does win is going to go on to face Seth, not Roman, at Mania. Um, I'm kind of undecided between Drew McIntyre and Seth at Mania, where Drew finally takes that belt from him, and or CM Punk, only because, not because I think or like CM Punk, but because that sells a lot of money and tickets and, and merch and whatnot, is having that name as champion. So I'm a little undecided, but if I've had to pick right now, what I'd want to see is Drew. What I think I'll see is CM Punk. So take that one to the bank. Okie dokie do, huh? And I will boot myself for it because, I, like I said, I really want Drew to win the, win the Rumble. <laughs> Drew McIntyre won me uh, like 300 bucks uh, when he won the 2020 Royal Rumble. So Really? 
Yeah. Yeah. yeah oh, thank well. you, Tommy Salami, for creating the pool. He did it oh. again this year. Yeah, he's doing illegal gambling. Let's keep talking no, about it. <laughs> no, not at all. No, I love Tommy. Um, but uh, I, I opted out I got, of his I pool. Got, I got 15 for Let's, the men's and number four for the women's. So if whoever wins oh, so. at those entries... All right, so whoever pot. so you bought a number. So whoever comes in at number fifteen, if they win the Royal Rumble, then you win the money. Yes. All right, and the women's whoever comes in at number four, whoever if they win, so when number four yep. comes out. Well, let's talk about the the women's Royal Rumble. If right now. number four comes in, out, is he, if Becky Lynch comes out, number four, you, I'm are, calling it. Yep. Oh, so you calling Becky as the winner? Becky as the winner. I hope she comes out at number four. Well, I'll, I'll tell you one thing. They've only got six women right now confirmed. confirmed. Wow, oh, that's going to be even great, too. Bailey, Nia Jax, Becky, uh, Bianca, Maxine, and Ivy. And I will be 100% honest with you when I tell you I think Nia Jax is going to win. I knew you were going to say that. I knew you were going to say that. Well, they really, really been pushing her deep on Raw. And um and, and having her whether it be matches promos I think that um they put a big spotlight on her and um I think that they're going to put her over at the Rumble and I think she will go to Mania not to face uh, Rhea oh, would whoever's the uh, SmackDown is it Bianca Belair maybe no she's not champ isn't it Io mm-hmm. oh yeah 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 Io you're right yeah I think Io and I think that stupidly is an easy win. Nia over Io. Right. We will see, Jay. But you're calling Becky the man, right? Uh, and I'm calling Nia Jax. Now, um, with them only confirming six entrants into this 30 women battle royal, um, or Royal Rumble, rather, um, I think that we will probably see a Tory Wilson. We might, yeah, yeah, okay, we might see something Victoria. like that. But. More Trish important, I, yeah, definitely a Trish, I think. But um, I think that between NXT and I think that they should use those women, okay? I think between NXT and the main roster that they have now, I don't think they're going to have a problem filling that ring with 30 women. And I no, think it's going to no, be pretty no. lit, you know? Um, I'm excited to see if they pull anybody um, up from NXT to throw into this Rumble and or if they bring anybody back. Super exci- super. Like I said, I'm excited for both rumbles, you know, um, with only those names announced. Yo, how how hype are you gonna be when it's three, two, one, one. and then the music starts playing that we haven't heard before, and we're all like, "Wait, wait, wait, who is that?" <gasps> Holy sh! It's Jade Cargill. Oh yeah, dude, I can't wait. I'm gonna I go through wait. the roof. Mark. Fuck out! I know. I'm so. I'm getting chills thinking about it now. How hype I'm gonna, gonna be. be number thirty. I'm gonna. I'm gonna call number thirty. Yeah, I'm telling you right now. If they don't use her for the rumble. Then why not? I mean, I still want her in NXT, but there's no reason why she can't be in the rumble. How hype? And she doesn't have to win, but how hype? Oh my god! That'd be hype. Lit. So stay tuned, guys. We're gonna have fun watching WWE Royal Rumble, and uh, I hope you enjoy the. Pre- These are the only matches they have announced. There's no women's championship matches. Seth Rollins is pretty much on the f- um, on the bench right now as champion because he's injured. Um, and that's all they've got announced. So uh, these Royal Rumbles will probably be at over an hour each. And then you've that's got two a, matches that are 35 minutes each. So we're looking at three and a half hours of wrestling or whatnot. Yeah. The Royal Rumble. And it, it, I mean, time wise, it sounds about right. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, and we'll, I mean, we'll probably get a couple promos and different things in there to fill some time and, you know, like some funny stuff, with, always, you know, yeah. like maybe our truth. You know, that's talking to Judgment Day and different stuff like that. I hope he's in the Rumble and eliminates yeah, I'm sure the ball. Oh, dude, that'd be a star. Dude, how? What a great storyline for our truth to be in the Rumble and be eliminating <laughs> the Judgment guys. Yeah, I would that'd be good. die. That'd be funny. How hysterical! I mean, that's GTS stuff that we would be doing. But it is what it is. Jay, any last thoughts on the Royal Rumble? I'm really excited. I'm really looking forward to it, and. Uh... It's going to be another good pay-per-view. I can't wait. Mm. Um, it's going to be another great PLE, Jay. Oh, sorry. Premium live event. No, I know. Um, real quick, what do you think about the news of Netflix and WWE? Yeah, that's huge, bro. That's huge. 2025, Crazy. we're going to be watching that's Monday Night That's going to be Night nuts Raw on, on Netflix. Netflix. And, uh, um, well, the Peacock deal is in place for like 10 years. 
But in 2025, everything like uh, overseas is all Netflix on WWE. Yeah. From what I heard. So that's wild. But I was going to cancel my Netflix account. I guess I'm glad I didn't. <laughs> guess you got to keep it now. Yeah, well, I guess I can cancel it for a year if I really want to. Yeah. But, uh, next year, I guess I got to pick it up. Yeah. Um, so with might that, as well just keep it. Yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys had some fun hanging here with Do Hop, with Jay. Yes, sir. The House of Hopcast. We love bringing it to you. I'm glad. Always on a Wednesday. Uh, and let us know in the comments who you think is going to win the Royal Rumbles and the championship matches. For real. Down and in the um, comments below. Yeah, you ain't kidding. Put the, all those comments. We're going to read them. Um, Jay, any last thoughts about the Regal, GTS Regal Rumble? I'm going to throw you out and become the Ultimo Champion. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, come on, man. Yeah, all right. Well, I hope you guys uh, are ready for some weekend of wrestling. Yeah, like this sure. video. Leave some comments if you haven't done it already. Subscribe for some more Do Hop and J. Yeah, baby. Yeah. I'm glad that we can do this even not feeling as great as we are, Jay. It was, uh, it was another day in the office. De dedication to you all. <laughs> We're out. Love you. Oh, wait. I have a button for that. Ah, uh, give him the flowers. Who knew? <laughs>